Hello everyone and welcome to this video about how to create a heat map using Excel. So in this file, so in this Excel file, I have some samples. So these samples are represented by latitude and longitude coordinate for location. And I have analysis for some elements like copper and the gold. So to create a heat map in Excel, so click on insert and click on 3D map. Then click on open 3D maps. So this icon will appear. So so fill list so let's click close this one we don't need it right now and what you will do so to create a heat map so here is under data so select this icon change to visualization to heat map and then for location so click on add field so click on this one so select latitude and then add longitude so click on add field and select longitude all right so let's zoom to my working area to see the my samples location then here under value so under value click on add field and select the element that you want to visualize so for example here gold and now what is important trick to do is here under layer options so expand layer options and then go to visual visual aggregation so here in visual aggregation so select average not sum so select average for color so let's keep it default so you can modify it to custom and you enter your own color so right now so let's keep it default and here for color scale so let's increase it lightly bit so this to show the anomaly to make them important and for same thing for the radius plus let's increase it lightly bit so select this legend let's move like this one so now to create to modify the background image so here go to teams and select the satellite image if you want to add satellite image as well as you can here reduce the opacity of this uh, map so by clicking on this one as you see right now the opacity or the the image become more transparent and by clicking on this arrow so here you can navigate easily on your image so to turn it right or left so zoom in and zoom so zoom out and zoom in it's okay so as well as you can add so let's by clicking on this one so let's it as it is so now we will see how to add map label so click on this one and now you to add label to your map so for annotation and more so this it was how to create a heat map using excel and what is important so here is under layer options and here in visual aggregation so select average so it will give you the real map of your data so thank you for watching and see you for next video